So a few days ago, a very exciting image was released of Fort Park's entrance and there sure is something very exciting outside. So without no further ado, let's get straight into the video. So an image released by Everything Fort Park shows us the former WWTP radio trailer and car outside the main security building of the Thought Park Resort. For some of you that are not familiar with WWTP radio, it was basically the exact same trailer but outside stealth and would play pop music and would sort of imitate a live radio show. WWTP radio. However, I think a few years ago, they actually did remove the trailer and truck from the stealth site and since then, I haven't seen it around the park. But from this photo here, we can see that the trailer is now sitting just in front of the security building at Thor Park. It looks like the trailer is now going to act as a food outlet and I really like all of the Coca-Cola branding on the trailer and also the huge orange Thor Park logo stretched across half of the trailer. So from this image we can assume that it's going to be in the exact place for the 2021 season. Personally I don't think it's the greatest place for this snack outlet as it's going to be one of the first things you see before you go into the actual main part of the park. Alongside that when people do get to the park they normally want to go straight in without no delay so I'm not too sure how many people are going to stop at this outlet before they head into the main section of the park. Due to the fact that this outlet is outside the main part of the park, we can assume that it's going to be operational from when the park opens till about 1pm and then open again when people start to leave the resort as in the time in between, I don't think many people are entering the resort except from if it's late night riding or of course a special event. So there we go, there's not much more to say about this outlet. I'm very excited to see what happens to the outlet. Will it stay there? How long will it remain there for? There sure is a lot of questions that will hopefully be answered very soon. If you did enjoy the video, consider subscribing as I make theme park content every week for you to enjoy. And before that's said and done, thank you for watching Theme Park Enthusiasts and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.